show you a clip from one of the stories that we covered for both Econato, Blogvis, and, uh, yeah, and Presidio Sentinel. And it's the opening of the Village Theater. The Village Theater here in Coronado has been uh, silent for about a Village Theater, the grand opening. Man, it is such a historic place here in Coronado. Been shut down for such a long time. But now the, the theater seats are awesome. The inside, the snack bar is awesome. And the very first movie they're showing, Cars 2. What a great way to launch this whole thing itself. We're at the Village Theater. There's been a lot of village people out here. There were Indians. There was a guy like a cop, a construction worker. I think they're heading up right now to see you upstairs. Let's go inside and take a look at uh, the Village Theater itself so you can see a little bit about the amazing transformation here at Coronado Island. I'm the manager here at the Village Coronado Theater and we're having an amazing fun time. We're all excited and we're cooking all the popcorn and we just can't wait. Hi, my name is Lucinda Bennett, proud Coronado native since 1989. I had seen one movie in a theater before we moved to America and then we moved to America and every week started coming to the movies here at the Village Theater. So now proudly after 11 and a half years, we get to come back again, and we're the first in line for the 945 show. My name is Lance Oswald, I'm with Vintage Cinemas, and you are now sitting in the brand new, never been used, Village Theater on this unbelievably beautiful island. Hi, I'm Setsi Wachta. Um, I was here in 1947 when the theater opened up, and they had searchlights, and I was just a little kid, about seven years old, and uh, don't remember a whole lot other than the recalling the scene, the, the lights uh, lighting up the sky, bouncing off the, off the clouds, and uh, uh, lots of people here, and, and uh, everybody's looking forward to, uh, to seeing the first run movie here. I think the, the uh, murals inside is beautifully done. That's what blew me away the most, actually, looking at the Coronado Island across the bay to the, the skyline of San Diego. It was just breathtaking. It's a whole different take on what cinema is and going to the theater. It was really nice. It wasn't what I was expecting. It was beautiful, I have to say that. I have to admit, like, everything was really nice. I, uh, I really like the glowing lights all over. You're standing on the terrazzo that we uh, restored. Uh, it was uh, original terrazzo connected to the building. It's been saved. Uh, and behind me is your all new concession, uh, your new designs, lighting, carpet, you name it. It's all new, brand new, I'm never so been I'm so excited to enjoy it myself, but then also bring a new generation um, here to enjoy it and see movies as they were originally intended to be. We knew, we knew there was a lot of anticipation to reopen the theater. And we wanted to come up with a plan that would give as many people as possible a chance to enjoy the grand opening ceremony. So instead of having one, we decided to have four. So this is sort of the, the, the dessert at the end of the day, because I'd like to see a movie here. So I, I wouldn't feel good about myself as a history teacher if I missed history. So I had to see the first one, I think. You actually have been inside and you saw Cars 2. First of all, how'd you like the movie? I, I loved the movie. It was pretty cool. Did you see the first one? Uh, yeah, I did. Is this one as good as the first one? Yeah, I think this one's better. Yeah, opening night for the Village Theater is my friend Jackson. Thanks for watching. I'm Lance Allspa. I'm with Vintage Cinemas based in Los Angeles. And we have just opened our third classic movie theater venue, the Village Theater, on the beautiful, beautiful island of Coronado. And I think everyone will have a great time if they come and check it out. It's 
been a tremendous successful opening. A lot of news coverage out here at the beginning of the day to talk about what was going on. A lot of people came out, a lot of happy campers saw the movie tonight. Uh, I'm standing here at the Village Theater. I'm looking for the Indian. I'm looking for the cop. I'm looking for the village people. I understand, David, they're already upstairs with you. For the Presidio Sentinel News and for Blog This, I'm Kevin Fulton.